Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is a weekend love bonus for you. This is applicable for singles, couples in a relationship or dating. This is for the Cancer sign. This is a weekend bonus May 10, 11, 12, and 13. Alright, weekend bonus please up until the 13th of May 2019. What can I get for, for Cancer sign? Universe, what can I get for Cancer friends? For this weekend love bonus, singles, couples in a relationship of dating. What is the significant message, please, for cancer sign? Weekend love bonus, please. What can I get for cancer, please? Weekend love bonus. First card is the star card in reverse. You might be dealing with an Aquarius. You've got the four of swords and king of cups. You've got the... um. The Six of Wands in upright position. For some of you, the initial message I'm getting is that you're going to win this. All right? You're going to get the attention. Let me just move the camera. Something about this weekend where you felt like it's 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 no use, less hope, less response, ignoring you, feelings and emotion, it's off. Something's not working. Something you thought was dead is still alive. <laughs> It's something about this week, you know, it could be going for you for the last two weeks, three weeks, four days, four months. But yeah, it was, for some of you, it's like, I'm hopeless. They haven't responded to me. They've been cold, you know, four of swords is sleeping, hibernating, cold, um, king of cups. I'm not really interested to you, I'm not being loyal to you, I'm not really keen to share my emotions and feelings. You don't have me. You don't have my attention. So all of this in reverse. This is I felt like in the past. So someone, someone whom you're dealing with, cancer, it's been giving you an off. You're like an, um, not very, not very promising response. All right, could be an Aquarius. It could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Swords. It could be um, an Aries. Let me just check. Swords, it could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So it could be any sign. But I felt like this three cards is saying you're not getting success, all right? Over the last three days, three weeks, four weeks, something about Aquarius sign. So it could be around April, Feb, March, April, King of Cups. So it could be three months, you know, so you've been, it's been stuck up for three months. First of all, you're not feeling really great, not hopeful. They've been ignoring you, King of Cups in reverse. You know, they're not really giving so much attention towards you. But you, because you're going to be victorious this weekend. So for some of you, it's been six months, six weeks from now. What is the victory towards this weekend, please? How can Cancer felt victorious about the weekend? Yeah, so victory and money and stability. So it Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. What else could I say? What is this star in reverse? Because I felt like cheating is ended. So because I felt like these three cards, this is, you know, this is past, all right? You could be dealing with someone who has been cheating with you or you thought they were cheating and then eventually you found out that they weren't. You know, they were, they were just simply busy. They were just simply disinterested. Because I felt like four of swords and then combination of king of cups is that I'm, I'm disinterested to you right now over you know this this is i'm not interested my feelings is not into you right now my attention is not on to this relationship or to this dating right now yeah this is star cards you know star card this is not 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 healed um not really hopeful star card are along the star card in reverse along with the four of swords is like you know what something is not working in between the two of us so let me just hibernate four of swords you know but they, you are in their thoughts they've just decided to it's not working it's not really feeling good not promising so let me distance myself to you so if you are in a situation where this person ghosted you in the last four days four weeks four months they ghosted you because they felt drained or they felt sick for some of you because the 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 health the, the the star card speaks about health for some of you, it could be actual help because this could speak about lying in bed. 
So for some of you, you are dealing with someone, hope, hopefully not, someone who is sick, who's been sick and um, weak, all right? You know, um, King of Cups, weak, sick. Or if, if this is not a physical health sickness, it could be that because you were having a lot of issues and misunderstanding about um, a cheating, you know, it, it, it could be around cheating. You might be suspecting that your partner, um, your husband, your wife, there's something fishy of their activity. So it's been a fight. It's been an ongoing issue. So this person decided to hibernate, to distance themselves because they're not really interested to show their affections and feeling towards you. They want to be selfish right now and rest up. For some of you, it's really been an exhausting journey. The star card in reverse, exhausted and not really hopeful that, you know, this this relationship or this dating would work. So they hibernate, you know, they distance themselves. So on on during the process of hibernating or... Why did I use hibernating? It's not uh, during the process of, of, of not talking to you, not really dealing with you or simply ignoring you, you know, they've, they've kind of realized that this is, this is so much, you know, and, um, they've decided like, it's, it's about time to wake up, you know, cause the, the next clarifying cards is the five of swords in reverse, which is like, this is a progress. They've been through a lot, whoever you're dealing with, you know felt like they've been through a lot you know or you guys have been through a lot a lot of ups and downs and you know they've decided to recuperate rest up or it could be you king of cups i try to be to to be this is weakness or i try i really want to be distanced with this relationship or with this person to heal or to be selfish of my feelings sometimes you you will be able to heal or you will be, be able to understand the situation if you back out you know king of cups is selfishness in terms of i want to be selfish of myself to you right now because you're not really reciprocating the feelings the affections the interest that i'm ready to give to you so let me be selfish let me rest up because i'm not really feeling great you know about you and me but i felt like excuse me this is in the past this is totally in the past it could be linked to a dispute about the marital affairs an affair a third party or this could simply means that you know it's it's a it's an ongoing issue a certain subject that it's ongoing someone is someone keeps bringing up the same old issues or um it's it's a subject that a person cannot drop that subject off and cannot move on you know because the card here is the card the card star card the, the the star card is also speaking about healing so they haven't really moved on they haven't healed with that particular subject it keeps popping in whatever is that issue is it, keep, it keeps occurring so this person decided to distance be all about me all right so but i felt like this is in the past this is behind this is what you guys are right now this weekend you're feeling you're feeling like you move on you have achieved because the the six of wands is a victory card you know it, it's it's winning the thing about the six of wands is that it's a winning um card it's a winning card um it's a card where it describes that this person he won the battle all right he won the war and you know that war takes you know, in, in movies, war takes one year, two years, three years, you know, a long period. So you're feeling victorious this weekend because you have overcome this. You've come a long way, right? That's the exact uh, energy I'm vibing. Is that you have come a long way with this relationship, with this day thing. It's been a lot of, you know, issues. For some of you, third party. For some of you, it could be an actual health issue. For some of you, it could be a subject where this person or you, um, you're not able to move on with a particular issue or subject. And it's it's been so long that you've been struggling to understand each other, how to resolve that issue. But this, you know, this, this weekend, you're being supported by the universe to channel the six of ones energy, which is winning. You will win over this obstacle. You know, this is obstacle. This is an obstacle, all right? 
you can win over in this person towards this obstacle right now. Let me just dig more details. What is the six of wands, please? How can cancer and this person, you know, win over the issue, get over the issue for dating, singles, and any relationship, please? Collective reading, collective message, please. Because you love each other. As simple as that. This actually appears in upright position. So let me... So, whatever obstacles you have, you know, everything's, all the cards is appearing in a, it, it was it was in reverse, this was in reverse, but for some reason when I pick it up, it's appearing to be in upright position. So, let's put it in upright position then, all right? Okay, so, I don't know what happened, but it, it, my intuition is saying, pick it up, pick the card up and read it this way. So, yep. That was in the past and going to the present, you know, it seems to be healthy. Uh, there's still, I felt like this five of swords, cancer, it was in reverse before. And in combination, how I put, I, I don't know what have, how I position this, but when I shuffled, pick up the card, there seems to be a message. So I'm going to interpret this. So for some of you, I'm picking up like from the past progressing to the second third week of may up until the end um this act this person is actually looking forward for some of you i'm picking up like they've they know their mistake you know they're being for some of you you're just laughing laughing about for some of you you're not taking it seriously what happened in the past it's like whatever happened in the past if it's just petty if it was blown out of proportion you know, it's saying laugh it out. You know, it's for some of you, um, you know, I don't see this negative in here. It's like this five of sword is looking at the king of cups. You know, he he is cheeky in terms of looking at the king of cups. Like I, I like I don't know what happened with this, but like looking over in the past, I have so much love for you. All right. So let me let me recall what happened in the past. Look at it one more time and you know, get out of this silliness. Because I felt like this person, whoever you're dealing with, if you are in a cheating situation or if you are in a person dating a person with an on and off, like giving you an inconsistency, they will realize that um they will realize that they they you know what they were before. You know, for some of you, there's a certain looking back, you know, this five of swords looking at the king of cups. So there's a person here who's looking back of how they are capable to love, be serious, be be consistent. And they feel great. So for some of you who, whom you are dealing with cheating, lying, or bastard <laughs> people, they're now reminiscing how it feels to feel good. How it feels to be a good person. So in I felt like this is a wake-up call. This, this is a five of swords. This is a cheeky, deceptive and they were they reminisce how they were before, how they were as a father, as a good partner, and it really feels good. So I felt like for some of you, this is a realization for the person you're dealing with, and it make them you know feel restless because how can I act this way over this person, over myself, over this relationship, where in fact it feels so good to channel how I was before. So there's this a release, a realization that upon um, realizing how, you know, great it is to be in, in a, in being a good man or being a good woman, they feel restless and thoughts coming out and, you know, they come home feeling victorious. So for some of you, this is really is a realization of someone's mistake, how they, you know, how, how they are before versus now. So it's. It, it doesn't have a tower moment, but I felt like, you know, four of swords in here. It's a beginning of a change. It's a beginning of a change for a person who's cheating, who is inconsistent. So there's maturity, the four of the, this four cards. There is a maturity. So this, you know, this second, third, third to fourth week of May, you're going to win over this relationship to make it work or the dating or to revive this connection or to revive this dating because at the end of the day when this person realize how it's good to be good you know the love would um would come back and eventually you guys would have stability again i don't think this is a weekly bonus 
I, I don't think this is a weekend a weekly. This is far more than that. So for some of you that has been struggling a lot, you know, it's been so long. For some of you who felt like it's been so long, I've been in this situation for quite a while. I've been cheated. I've been lied upon. I've been played fool by some inconsistency. There is changes that's going to happen. All right. And, um, and it's about and it's about a person discovering that it is good to offer a good love. It's about goodness. It's about a person coming back to who they are before. And they realize how good it is to be good. How good it is to feel good love, right love. And coming home victoriously, connecting with you, getting back the family. All right. So I don't I don't think it's really just a weekend one. It's 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 it's, it's over that. So for some of you, Cancer, who felt like you've been in this situation for quite a while, where you haven't feel, you know, the, the exact energy I'm tapping and seeing in here, Cancer, is that every time you try, block. Every time you, 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 you try to fix things, you understand, block. You know, there's always blockage. This time around, during the Toro season, May month, you would feel that the wave is more progressing. Like before, every step you make, every time you dive to fix it, block. Every time you try, block. Come back. Try again, block. You know, this time around, the wave is more progressive. That's why the victory card is here. So this is for you, Cancer. If you feel like um, I am talking to you as if you're connected with the exact story line where you felt like... This is me. This is how I was. I am up until right now. My friends, this may, there's been, you know, an internal changes from this person that you're dealing with. That the wave, you know, there's no more blockages in terms of how you, how you sail your life and love and romantic. It's going to be smooth and uh, more, victor more, more victory, more winning over you. Okay. I don't think this is just a weekend one. But I felt you I felt like you would start to feel the vibe this May about change, a person's behavior changing, situation changing for the better. Okay? So this is for you, Cancer. Thanks for being here. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell. If you click the notification bell, it's gonna give you an instant message to notify you that I uploaded a video. And thank you again. It's been a pleasure doing this to you, Cancer. And for my followers and subscribers, thank you very much for your donation this week. And I'll see you soon again. Bye-bye.